who's ever running that newspaper, they got a reliable source to be able to come up with all this info. But anyway, this is your boy, me, welcome to the channel where anime and manga news more. And this time we're reviewing One Piece chapter 699. Akiki keeps Smoke Dog from getting chopped up. Smoke will almost look like Buggy in it. <laughs> I mean, he would look just like Buggy in one mission. Back to the Straw Hats. Tiny Mind's trying to jack up Zoro. He notices that uh, Zoro has Illumin Sword. So I guess he thinks that he's, I don't know what he thought he did. He did, he's the cause of some horrible thing or something just because he defeated Illumin. But really, he don't know the whole story. It's really just a zombie. So it turns out Dark Flamingo doesn't want any problems from Kaido. Why? Because he renounced his uh, Super Kai status. So he must think, okay, I I'd rather compete with the world government than Kaido. But then also, if y'all remember back in the war, he said, I don't even want to, to be Super Kai. He's only doing it because it's convenient for him at the time. So what did he have planned? Or did that also come into play? But it seemed like he did that pretty quick. Like, no problem. He said, okay, I just got to, you know, give up my Super Kai status. So that must mean that he might have had something against the world government for, for, to begin with. Or he really doesn't want any problems with Kaido. And the crazy thing was, everybody ended up in the newspaper. They had every all the alliances, everything that happened, they had everybody in there. And at the end of the chapter, the Straw Hat's next agenda is to bring it to Dark Flamingo's front door. They're bringing it to him. They said we're going to full steam into him. So I guess they're going to have to take him out before they get Kaido. The beginning didn't really excite me. Like, really, I was kind of confused. I was like, why is Akiki there? What, what is he doing in the first place? And, you know, it's kind of cliche, you know, somebody's going to get beat up, let's go save him. So it really didn't excite me. All he did was say, oh, Dark Flamingo uh, is a threat to the world government. That could be interesting later on, but it really didn't, you know, excite me this time. Now, the, what was supposed to be comedy in this episode was kind of weird, man. I don't know about you, but I'm not going to let my kid, you know, go, you know, take a, a bath with, you know, somebody that I just met. I mean, it's kind of more weird. If it would have been a man, it would have been crazy. I'd be like, what? <laughs> you know, I'm not going to get butt naked with somebody else's child and take a shower with them. <laughs> now, if it was a woman, it's kind of, it's less weird, but it's still kind of weird. You know, butt naked taking a shower with some little kid. That was kind of weird. I was like, Ugh, I don't know about that. But anyway, the other three uh, were uh, uh, Tiny Mind, Brooke, and Tiny. They were jealous. The interesting thing was Dolph Flamingo and Akiki. That was the interesting thing in this app, in this chapter. What's interesting to me is, did Akiki join the revolutionaries or was he part? Because he already said he really didn't, you know, care too much for the uh, world government. And we already seen that before in, the, you know, other chapters and stuff like that. He let Robin get away. He let a few people, you know, he was kind of lenient. You know, he went to certain islands and didn't really fight. You know, he saw the Straw Hats, didn't even confront them. So... He had some kind of ulterior motive. And we already knew he wasn't really the most loyal uh, 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 admiral. What you call him? Uh, what is it? Um, um, uh, uh, Akainu. He, he, I think he's the most loyal. If, 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 and Akiji, he's nothing like him, man. He was so lenient. So maybe he never really had, maybe he was an admiral just because, like the same reason Dolph Flamingo was a super guy. He needed to use it. It was convenient at the time. I don't know. But the crazy thing about that is it takes so long to be an admiral. He had to work his way up for so long. What, what is his real goal? Maybe he was just trying to make a difference in the world. Now he thinks, okay, I found out the government's shady, so now I'm going to become a revolutionary. Maybe that's the case. I think he might become a revolutionary. Another thing is, is Dolph Flamingo coming for the world gov? Because they said, Akiji said that he's a threat to him. Not only that. He relinquished his title as Super Kai so quick. That's what they said, you know, just what the uh, Straw Hat said. So maybe he already had a plan. Like, I'm going to come at the world government anyway, so it's better to come at them now than to face Kaido and the world government later on. You know, so that makes that, that would make sense if that was the case. And one other thing is, like I, like I said before, I don't know how these... Did Dolph Flamingo, you know, uh, 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 try to, you know, get uh, law? Because... How did they find out that Law and Luffy was in the, in, in cahoots? That was so quick. I think that Dolph Flamingo probably said it because you know if I got to give up my Super Kai status, you got to give it up. Maybe they maybe they want to relinquish his status because he they found out he's in co cohorts with um with uh pirates. I think that's 
that that seems real convenient for Dolph Flamingo. He may be the one giving up the information. And since and um, I don't know who who are the other people coming after. I don't don't leave that in the comments. I, I can't remember. Um, or maybe they didn't say who the other alliance coming for. But since Dolph Flamingo is involved in other world, underworld, he probably would know that. You know, get no information like that. But anyway, go ahead and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Rate the video and subscribe. And I'm out. Peace.